What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, IGB Fam. You know, we back again with another video. As y'all can see by the today's title, Boyfriend Cheats on His Girlfriend, Disclaims Her and Everything for a Model, and Gets Hard in Public, y'all. He gets hard in public. How y'all get hard based off of conversation in public? But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Run it up for your boy. Share. Share the video. Sharing is caring. It's free. Now let's jump into this video. He's only ever been with skinny girls. You know, he's too good. That's the problem. Yeah, all right. I'll try tea latte. Did you know any more? Did you wear? Yeah, well, you know, it's not a lot. Don't get coffee usually in the summer? Actually, I'm not making coffee tonight. What was your name? I'm Charlie. Hi, Helen. Helen. Now that's crazy for him to initiate to get a phone number when he has a girlfriend. But again, hey man, I don't know what too friendly is. So y'all let me know down in the comment below what is too friendly. Was he being too friendly when he started the conversation? Or like he did mention like, you know, as friends or like I guess hang out, hang out. I don't know how older people say it. I'm not I'm not that old, but damn. But like for real dog, like Y'all consider this cheating right now or he's just, you know, being a friendly guy. Sons of my right. Are you good down there? See that. Are you taking down here sometimes? Show me your moves. You don't want to dance? Why do you like dancing? I don't know. I just met you. I don't know. Do you have a phone for that? Come on. I'm good. That's crazy. That's crazy. This man does not hesitate to say he did not have a girlfriend. Now, when a man does not hesitate to fucking claim you in public, bro. That gotta hurt. That gotta hurt. But I'm not hurt. So it doesn't hurt me. <laughs> it don't hurt me. But still, that's that's crazy. No hesitation, just straight no. Figured, you know, go get some drinks sometime, dinner or something. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I can be a little evil at times, can't lie. Well, there's nothing wrong with being bad, right? You seem like you're on the bad side. You're really funny. Okay, thanks. disgusting that that was very you know unpleasant to watch very unpleasant now you're only like what two to five minutes into a conversation and you let the bitch seduce you off words she didn't even touch the nigga or nothing just off words this nigga got hard Nah, that's crazy. Because I know, for, for me personally, the bitch got to be feeling on top of me. Nah, not just, you know, verbally. Oh, my God! I don't know what's going on down there, but I'm not what you were expecting. Not even slightly. An omission like that, that yeah. is cheating. When she straight up asked him, do you have a girlfriend? Yeah. And he said no. Well, no, we're exclusive. The way that he was looking at her, you could, you could, you could tell. That's, that wasn't friendly. That was, yeah, I'd be down to Well, some of our accomplices are willing to go all the way. We just went to go see Wonder Woman. I was watching him during the movie, and I really felt like, like, really respected women in a way that he didn't before. See, that's the thing. People have two sides to them. They're going to have that one side, you know, where it's lovely and bubbly and all that shit. And then they're going to have another side where you never 
exploited to me. That's why when y'all meeting people, y'all online, in person, whatever the fuck it is, make sure you get to know the people for real. Because people can switch up like this at any moment. I don't understand. Maybe he was just staring at Wonder Woman all the time. I want to go see it again now. Yep. Yeah. Watching the movie. It's forgivable, boys will be boys kind of thing. Yeah, no. Boy, can girls be girls? How about that? Girls get account I've never are heard accountable that. for their actions. You never heard that, never right? Heard that exactly. Before. What's next? I mean, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna stay with them? Are you gonna... <laughs> no. You're not gonna stay with them? I'm tough in his ass today. <laughs> really? Do you uh do you wanna like call him and um <sighs> So you have this new friend that you met at Starbucks, huh? Okay, you see, at that point, if you knew he was going to cheat or you thought of what he was going to do, you should have never put him in the test. You should have just left his ass. Simple as that. It could have saved you a headache. It could have saved you a heartbreak. It could have saved you so many traumas. But you want to be the, the one that put him to the test. Now, I'm not necessarily saying it's her fault, y'all. It's not her fault. It's his fault. His actions, you feel me? But again, it takes two to create a problem. Oh, I knew. I knew. You did not. You knew. You knew. Right. No. Oh, I should know better than to question your loyalty. Right. Okay. Well, here's how. Well, she seemed like your type because you adjusted your d after she left. How about that? That's crazy. I got a new belt and it felt a little small. So this man just aired out that he has a small dick. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Do some in and out is crazy. Now, Charlie, I don't know what to say to you. I don't know you personally. I don't give a fuck about you. You fucked up. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Running up for your boy. As always, I'm going to catch you on the next video. Keep splurging. Like the video. Share the video. It is free. Don't cheat.